What have you got there? Have you got mail that you're gonna open? It's I've good. got mail. Did I, just, I get mail? Well, we'll pretend it's mail. It's mail that makes AT go away. I just realised because the envelope screen, the green screening us out of here. So, given this comes from Ireland, when it came, I think this might be a St. Patrick's Day card from my friend Franklin. Oh, wow, this is remarkably specific. St. Patrick's Day wishes across the miles to Australia. To Australia. See, look, he can't even speak English. What the hell is that? Uh, Dennis. Well, Patrick's there, so it's happy St. Patrick's Day, I suppose. Oh, I was going to say Gaelic. Dennis and Michael, um, yeah, fielders. Anyway, so, hey, normally wouldn't consider Paddy's Day a card-giving occasion, but I saw the card and figured, why not? Well, you're seeing it was so incredibly specific. A card from Ireland addressed to Australia. Mind uh, you, I mean, that's, you know, that could be half the population. So you've been a bit tight. There you go, Australia. Yeah. Yeah, you know, that's where your roots are. Yeah. You know, that's all where the criminals came yes. from. And that is what he said. Pretty sure he had Irish roots. Yes, pretty much anyone Caucasian in Australia who's more than a couple of generations gone. Is... Oh, I didn't do it, Your Honour. I really didn't. You don't need to hang me for that. <laughs> Was pretty much what they all said. And Your Honour went, oh, put him on a boat. I just remember that bit from the young ones with the convicts going to Australia. Off to Australia for us. We're condemned for our accents and our stations in life. We're not good enough for them lords. Yeah, M4 and M murders all you right, done. You know, all M murders what you done. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> okay, so no Guinness or Bailey's flavoured chocolates. Bummer. But totally spur of the moment. Celebrating today. Have a good one. Uh From Franklin Joy and Oishin. I always get the... Dennis. Little... I've Dennis. Said Derek. I said Derek before, didn't I? Yeah. There's Derek. Yeah. Hey. yeah. Disappear and shame, Maisie. Uh, ah, yeah. there I am. Oh, I can do... Oh, check it out. I could work blue. What? Check out my bits. Yeah. Oh, right. Yeah. They're all the way up here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Nah. yeah all my bits. There's no yeah. way I'm Prima King in a penis there. It's not going to happen. Now, this one is from the US of A. I can tell by the flags and freedom on it. Mm. And it's also it's from Kesha in Memphis. A uh, long time friend of the channel. Happy St. Patrick's Day. She knows how to spell Derek. Yes. All right. So what have we got? We've got, ooh, a letter. And you like zombies and Doctor Who? Figured you might like this one. For the sleep mask, I thought it would be a funny present that it also involves zombies. If you like everything, try and send you something else early. Oh, yeah. And it's love. We get love from the fans. We get. Okay. Somebody gets. Okay. I don't get. I get love. I get my people being uh, abused. Uh, uh, their uh, rights being trampled on. Yeah. Uh, check this out. S sleep mask. Wear this on your next international flight. Now, again, because this is green, it's going to mess up with the chroma key, I'm pretty sure. But wear this on your next international flight while you're That's sleeping. That's pretty cool, actually. It is. That is it? actually pretty cool. Yeah. 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 Wake at your own risk. That's dickhead. awesome. Yeah. yeah. I, no, I like loving that. that. And uh, a mighty fine. Uh, Zombie themed t shirt again. Being zo Oh, it's a Walking Dead t shirt, my favourite TV show. Woo! Hang on. What? It's the Doctor Who. Where's the Doctor Who? Show me. It's on the bottom left. You think that's the Doctor, do you? Yeah. I think you've got an active imagination, Sonny, but. Yes. Mighty fine. Uh, the return season of The Walking Dead. I'll celebrate this. I'm going to watch it a bit later, actually. I'm not. So, you know why? Because I'm, I'm in bloody solidarity with my people as we're trying to get educated and get jobs. Other people, other people aren't even giving the roles to zombies. They're giving them to actors and they put green on. Huh? Huh? Isn't that a weird argument people get into? I rock it up to a bloody... Walking Dead, say, just off the top of my head and said, give my people a job. They go, you smell funny and you've got to get to the back of the coffin. And we go, oh, oh, like that. And they go, quick, they're going for brains. Shoot them in the head. And I'd go, oh, oh. I'd go, I wouldn't do that because I'd get shot in the head. I'd go, mm, mm. I'm so going to be firm with you and a judge. And then I'd say, judge, judge, my people are getting abused. They're not yep. um, minorities being respected, 
and then the judge would go, you smell, get to the back of the coffin, and I'd go, oh, oh, and then the shot to the head thing again. Yeah. He's a and, but, but that's like, remember, um, Daniel Day-Lewis doing My Left Foot, you got actors who had cerebral palsy complaining that they didn't give the job to someone with cerebral palsy, they gave it to an actor. They gave it to an actor. And when people play cross-cultural things, like Meryl Streep played the Australian, Lindy Chamberlain, but she also plays nationalities. The, the most recent one I can think of is Cloud Atlas, because the story is of the same people encountering each other in all through history. Mm. And they set one of the stories in Korea. Yeah. And only one of the main actors, uh, uh, she's Korean, and the rest are Caucasian. And so they put them in yellow face, basically, prosthetic makeup to give them the slanty eyes, which upset a lot of Asian people. Um, and it wasn't even particularly convincing yellow face, but this is a Wachowski's film. Yes. Um, and not the Wachowski brothers, because one of them came out as trans not that long after The Matrix. And I think people didn't necessarily take him seriously at first, because they were into weird poly bondage stuff They do before. now. Yeah, very serious. Um, so it's not by the Wachowski brothers, it's by the Wachowski's uh, brother and sister. Yes, uh, by the Wachowski so, siblings. Yeah, so... Um, uh, incidentally, them and the Coens are the only people I think the American Directors Association will recognise as co-directors on a film. Yeah. Because they don't allow co-directors. But no. because the Coen brothers work so closely and the Wachowskis work so closely, mm -hmm. they allow them to uh, be co-directors. On Sin City, Robert Rodriguez is the director, but he listed Frank Miller as co-director because he works so closely with the cartoonist. Uh, uh, Frank Miller who uh, penned the original Sin City yeah. and he listed them as co-directors and the American Directors Association said no, no uh, that's against our rules you can't do that and Rodriguez said I do everything myself I have my own studio set up in Mexico fuck all of you I renounce my membership of the American Directors Association and I will do whatever the fuck I want wankers and he did he did and that's listed as Directed by Robert Rodriguez uh, and Frank Miller. Mm -hmm. And he's not allowed in Hollywood now. No, he's not allowed in Hollywood. And he doesn't really give a shit because he shoots all these films in Mexico in his own studio. Yeah, he shoots zombies too. He yeah. does. Yeah, you wouldn't watch Planet Terror because no. of the zombie overtones. It's yeah. just, you know, it's like quail. If you've got to shoot quail that are flightless, then you should be shooting lawyers instead. Yeah, that the yeah, 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 Dick Cheney school of thought. That's right. Don't shoot quails, shoot rich old men. Exactly. It makes perfect sense. And so if a zombie came out and said that directly, oh, who would be getting it in the head then? Mm, Dick Cheney? No, no. A zombie would. Yeah. I've got to turn my phone off. Yeah, you turn your phone off. I got mine on because we're gonna want these Russian names. Yeah. And I'm not uh, actually turning it off, I'm just turning it so you silent. don't get any signal in, so no one can call me. Yep, yep, I'll do the same bad. thing. And um, that's that's our warm-up for the evening, and uh, we'll now wangafat this sucker up. We will, I've got, I've got to get into my Russian yeah, Russian. Showcasing, check Take it out. Alright, do the borderline. Be back soon. <laughs>